people. Today we are going pumpkin picking. Go right through the pumpkin face and don't get lost. Is this the pumpkin face? No. Don't get lost. I'm lost. We are venturing into the woods. Too spooky. Way too spooky. Ooh. Ooh. What do you want to do first? Corn maze. Corn maze. Before we uh, enter the corn maze, let's look at the rules. Stay on the trails. Don't pick the corn. Enter at your own risk though. Try to solve the maze. All right, Amy, so you told us to go right and we hit a dead end. I'm picking the new direction. We're gonna go straight and we're gonna go, oh, <laughs> dead end. This would be a good setting for a horror game. Ooh, I can see the new Outlast being. Rotten corn. When are we gonna play the new Outlast? I don't know. You guys want us to play Outlast 2? Let me know in the comments. Bruh. <laughs> Damn it. Dude, we suck. All right, left. We have to go left. Dude, this would be so much more fun at night. Straight or right? Straight looks like a dead end. Straight is a dead end. Straight, yeah, straight up looks like a dead end. All right, we're going right. We've been walking for 50 minutes. No end in sight. <gasps> this is clearly a dead end, right? I feel like where they have the grass, it's a dead end. It is a very, uh, dry trail. All right, if it's so easy, right or left? left. Confident in that answer? Mm -hmm. Oh, look, they're coming back. That means this wasn't the right way. Can you say, dead end? <laughs> Amy, you know what they call people like us? What? Maze runners. Kinda, I, think we, I think we should go way. straight. I think we should go straight. Maze runner. <laughs> I feel like the more we progress into the maze, the more dead the corn is. Like, look at this. This is dead as shit. Maze runner. Bum, ba, dum, bum. <laughs> oh, shit. I broke it. That wasn't me. Going right or left. I think this will be a dead end. This walkway is almost too straight. Oh, grass. Grass is usually dead ends. We were on a roll. Actually, we don't even know if we're on a roll. We could be like in the middle of the maze right now. Amy, you know we've been in this maze for 11 minutes now. I've been in mazes for like two hours. Seriously? Yeah. One time I was in a maze um, for so long that like they were, it was closing time and they had to come like push us out. Damn. <laughs> okay, I don't know why I'm letting you choose the path. Clearly, <laughs> you're not an experienced maze runner. Oh my God, look where you, look where you brought us. <laughs> Dude, is that a path? No. No, but look at it. It's, it's just wide enough small. to be considered a path. For like small children. All right, vlog squad. I'm gonna try to figure out how to get out of the maze. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, we have no idea where we're going. All right, guys, we're lost. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know if I could get us back to the start at this point. <laughs> we might have to trailblaze our own way through this maze. See, if I was really trying my hardest to do the maze, I would leave some sort of marker at every intersection so I know if I've been there or not. Ooh, I think we're making progress. Wow, that, that was so unenthusiastic. Yay. That was also unenthusiastic. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. All right, all right, I actually, how far into the maze do you think we are? Bro, what happened here? Corn. You know, the old folklore said this specific dude, corn. Dude, dude, dude. Did we just beat it? I think so. Ooh, we did it. We did it. Yeah, this isn't the entrance, right? Oh my God, we did it! Now it's time to pick some pumpkins. We were in the maze for a total of 22 minutes, according to my camera. So we got this little guy. We got this boy. We got this like BB-8 Star Wars set to turn the pumpkin into a BB-8. So we're gonna do that to that one. Uh, and we got these two small ones. I wanna talk to you guys about a vlog I was going to do. I was going to vlog me going to the Knicks home opener against the Detroit Pistons. I went with my friend Jason who was in town for the week. It's also why I didn't upload a lot last week. I was afraid the Knicks like security wouldn't let me bring my vlog camera into Madison Square Garden. Like I brought it to Staples Center and it was fine, but for some reason I was like, oh, New York, they won't let me do it. So I didn't bring it, so I didn't really vlog it, but Jason and I filmed this like lightsaber fight for it, so I figured I'd just show you guys the shitty vlog I tried to make with that. Yo man, I just got tickets to the Knicks opener. I'm so pumped. I've never seen a game in the garden before. This is gonna be so sweet. Wow, I just, Jason? Yo, I'll call you back. What are you doing here, man? I'm here for those New York Knicks tickets. Well, actually, man. No, 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 actually. I said, I'm here for those New York Knicks tickets. I've been wanting to do this for a long time. 
long time. I consider myself a meat aficionado. Aficionado? Aficionado. Today I'm going to be eating a kangaroo. Now you're asking, Jidel, where are you going to buy a kangaroo to eat? There is a specialty hot dog and sausage place that sells very crazy sausages and hot dogs from different countries around the world. Last time I went there, I got the French one, which was covered in foie gras, which I guess is what? It's like duck fat or something. It was, it was aight, it was aight. But today I'm gonna be trying a kangaroo and I might try a python sausage too. So yeah, we're gonna be there now. We made it and sadly, they're out of python sausage. One bite in Bangkok, python sausage, but that's okay. They still have the underdog sausage made out of kangaroo. Would you ever eat the, would you ever eat a kangaroo sausage? I would. So Amy got the Swedish dog. I got the underdog made out of kangaroo, uh, onions, some sort of cheese, and I got the German dog, which is bratwurst, um, and other stuff. And we got truffle fries. Well, <laughs> kind of tastes like spicy beef, but like, not as chewy as spicy as beef. It's like a little tougher. Hmm. Interesting. It's almost like dry and juicy at the same time. It's really strange. I would recommend it though. I'm, I'm gonna get it next time. But first we gotta try the python. What are we doing now? Getting shoes. Getting shoes. We're getting shoes? Yeah. We're getting shoes. Shoes, 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 shoes. They were playing really loud music in there so I couldn't vlog. But the funniest thing happened. Amy was getting her shoes. She needed to get wedges. No one knows what wedges are. But she needed to get wedges for something. And she asked the person working there what he thought and he said to be honest those don't look very good <laughs> he was dissing your shoe choice i was mildly offended i've never seen somebody legit be like you know what that outfit you picked out is trash yeah. does that happen to any of you <laughs> Let me know. The reason I haven't uploaded a lot lately is this freaking game, Destiny 2. This game takes up so much time. This game just came out on the computer. It's been out on consoles for about two months now, but it just came out on computer. If you play the game, you know what I'm about to tell you, but it's been out for three days, four days now. And your boy's already 274? Oh, I play this game way too much. It's so addicting. I. I just can't help it, so I need to stop playing this game. Hope you guys enjoyed the first vlog in a long time. I haven't been vlogging a lot lately. I'm gonna get back on the upload, grind, upload a lot more like I did earlier in the year, in November and December. And then big things are coming January, February, so look forward to that, boys. Leave a like for the vlog, comment what you think, and peace!